My name is Cheryl Lord Hernandez, and I'm the Director of Organizational Development at Morena Health Center. I'm responsible for leading a team of four other uh, people. We're all trainers. Uh, we lead leadership development efforts. We spend a lot of our time on new employee orientation and on teaching software systems for our medical center. We have a CEO who started with us about three years ago and he's really passionate about education and learning and continued learning. And so one of the challenges that we have is in uh, our medical center, we have people who are very expert in their clinical areas. So we have nurses, we have physicians, we have nurse practitioners, we have therapists, and they're very expert in their clinical area and they can become shining stars in that area but when we need a manager of one of those teams, if we want to choose one of them, one of those shining stars, they don't always have the management skills and the leadership skills that they need to do that new job well. And so um, being able to provide some of the, the leadership development software systems and learning through our Leadership Advantage program has been really key. I work very closely with Christina Kuntz. She's our uh, account specialist, and she's really great. I tend to be very, uh, serious and task focused and she helps me bring fun into it. So she brings me lots of ideas about how to market our program. Marana Health Center has 450 employees right now and we are getting ready to expand into another site so we're going to have 500 employees very soon. So my team of four trainers and myself as an additional trainer support all 500 employees on training them at least something, whether it's just their initial orientation or the software systems that they need to be able to use uh, as well. We use our Skillsoft content in a number of ways. The first way is to concentrate on specific themes. So every single month we roll out a theme, whether it's communication or ethics or challenging employees, something like that. The other way that we use it is for initiatives like the Six Sigma Green Belt Program uh, that we've done, and we're continuing to do that as new leaders come in. Um, we also are now kicking off a new mentorship program. So we're going to have a group of about 10 mentees, 10 mentors uh, going through the program. We're gonna be using both the leadership development uh, content that Skillsoft has, as well as the desktop skills, because we find a lot of our new potential leaders don't necessarily have a tight grasp of Excel or Word or PowerPoint. They may have a little, but they really need to hone those skills a little bit. So we're gonna layer in those courses along with some of the leadership development courses. Using Skillsoft has been uh, a key component in changing the culture of our organization. We are moving from a culture of, you know, give somebody 15 minutes of training and put them on the floor and tell them to do the best that they can do, to really taking them under our wing and making our training program very, very rich. The challenge is that when I have a nurse or a nursing director in front of me saying, patient care is more important than this learning, the challenge becomes how do I engage that person because yes, the health of that patient that's in front of that person is important and helping that nurse understand that her development, her professional development in a leadership capacity is going to ultimately help our patients as well. Um, I have to make that argument and Skillsoft helps me make that argument.